electoral votes, which is why it is a big part of that national conversation. And Harris County is a big part of the Texas conversation. While you were sleeping, the battle over drive through voting in Harris County raged on. Late last night, the same group that took this case to the Texas Supreme Court and a federal judge asked the Fifth Circuit Court of Appeals to shut down drive through voting on Election Day. In a very short decision, the court denied that effort, but it came hours after the ruling from Judge Andrew Hainan, a George W. Bush appointee, that the 127,000 votes cast at drive through stands in Houston are valid. That decision is expected to be appealed, but here's what the attorney for the GOP lawmakers and activists who filed these lawsuits said. We haven't won everyone, but you've got to keep fighting if you expect to win one. We believe that the law is on our side and ultimately we believe that we will be vindicated. Harris County Clerk Chris Hollins tweeted a nine part thread in response to the ruling, which includes a big change for Election Day. He says he cannot in good faith encourage voters to cast their votes in tents if that puts their votes at risk. The issue of structures came up during yesterday's hearing. So today the only drive through voting center is going to be at Toyota Center. Holland says that fits the judge definition of a building. The county has more than 800 other polling locations. You can find those on harrisvotes.com slash locations. We also have a full interactive map on khou.com. And Holland's wrapped up pointing out that there are still more than a million registered voters left who haven't cast their ballots yet in Harris County. Polls are open until 7 tonight. As long as you are in line by 7, you'll be able to vote, Xavier.